Hello, all my friends. I'm Oliver from Token Hobby. So this one, it is DT660, the bulldozer from Lesu. So we paint it and customized and get it assembled. So now we will start to see how it operates and the radio settings for this i6s. First, light. Have sound and have warning light. Can change in different. Start the pump and uh, the blade angle can change. Also for tilting. Up and down. Rear side, the reaper. Also can lift up. So now the load only 30%. If we increase more, it will rise more easily. Let's see the radio settings. So go to function. First, let's see the auxiliary channels to see each channel for each control. So, one to four is not showing here. So, this is channel one. Start the pump, you will see channel one, that's for changing the angle of blade. Channel two, that's right side track. Right track. Channel three, left track. Channel four, for tilting the blade. Channel 5, SWA, that's the pump. Channel 6, SWB, that's the sound. Channel 7, VRB, that's for uh, rising and up, up and down the blade. Channel 7, VRB. Channel 8, SWD, that's the light. Channel 9, VRA, that's the rear side reaper, up and down, VRA. Channel 10, SWC, that's the warning light, can switch, change different mode, different flashing. Okay, that's all 10 channels used. So, we still have the through to sound. The through to sound, the wires, it is connected with jumper wire to channel three. So not directly connect to the receiver. It is connected with jumper wire with channel three. So channel two, separately no have sound. Also, if you can, now the all the channel because all 10 channels all used. If you have more channel for another radio, you can plug the through to sound to one separate channel and set up mix control for two track have the engine sound. Now let's see the end points. So channel two, that's right side track. So left and right, the track and the gears the resistance are different. So even the motor have same power, so the speed will be not be same. So have to change the end points. For channel two, less, so it can be meet with same speed for each side. So channel five, that's the pump, 30% for the pump. If you want more power, you can increase like 40, 50 more. Not too much yet, not too much pressure for the hose. Okay, that's the end point. And also reverse, can check here, channel two and three, now it is reversed, so pushing forward, it's going forward. Also, the trims now no more only the endpoints and sub trims we also can check. It's all zero, so all in the middle. Okay, that's all the setting, settings. So from this page, you can see which channel is moving. So this cover can be open. So here, that's the well block. Also on top, cover open. The well block and the pressure well 
down there, that's the oil tank. Can fill up oil from the other side, open the cap here. And here, the cabin door can be open, so this window glass, the paper still not to rip off. After rip off, it is transparent window. Okay, rear side, that's the ripper and the cylinder here. And this cover, after open, you will see the battery chamber. So inside, we put the receiver also inside. Here, these two cylinders, that's for the blade up and down. And downside, these two cylinders, that's for changing the blade angle, two cylinder. And this cylinder here, that's for the bucket tilting. That's the cylinder for tilting. This one on there, that's a connecting rod for keeping balance. 